Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Subscribe for more new videos. Today, we have some recent updates on the Iraqi dinar. News from GR Militiaman, Iraq has a project to delete the zeros, but it hasn't happened yet. Iraq doesn't have an internationally acceptable tradable currency just yet. News from Group Pimp, the community is buzzing about the upcoming meeting between the WTO and Iraq on July 8. Something can RV, revaluation, needs to happen before then, but that's not the case. The WTO doesn't deal with exchange rates it focuses on the regulation and transparency of trade between countries. Intel from Group Frank 26, in my opinion, Iraq will revalue the dinar at a fixed rate, potentially $3.22. This fixed rate might see a small and quick float because it will likely reach the cap very quickly. The Coordination Committee for Exchange Companies has announced a general strike in Baghdad. According to Shafak News Agency, this decision comes after the Central Bank of Iraq's insistence on pushing companies towards forbidden actions and ignoring their legitimate demands. Following an expanded meeting, the exchange companies decided to start a general strike and complete closure. They will refrain from entering the auction starting Wednesday. July 10, 2024, until further notice for all governorates. Iraq is preparing to implement a new central bank decision in about six days, which limits the delivery of dollars to travelers inside airports. The Parliamentary Finance Committee described this decision as a measure to curb illegal activities. Jim Cougar, a member of the Finance Committee, said the decision will prevent sales from other currency outlets ensuring that money reaches actual travelers. Since it, exchange rates have seen a chronic rise, with the selling prices in exchange offices reaching 150,000 dinars for every $100. The Financial Supervision Bureau revealed that during the first half of 2023, over 150,000 citizens purchased dollars for travel purposes but did not travel. This means they obtained $600 million and sold it on the black market, benefiting from the currency difference.